Hey everyone, and welcome back. So in this episode, I am going to be setting up the battle for Bunker Hill, and then taking part in the battle. Our latest intelligence tells us you've infiltrated the Institute, and liberated a valuable holotape from their facility. I'm quite disappointed you chose to build the signal interceptor without the Brotherhood Knight. However, you've secured passage to and from their facility which was one of our primary goals. So, I'm willing to overlook your lapse in judgment, since you've unexpectedly accelerated our plans. I now have two missions for you to complete. First and foremost, I want you to bring that holotape to Proctor Ingram right away. There could be data vital to the success of our mission on that tape, so we can't afford to take any chances. The second part of your mission requires a bit of background to explain. About ten years ago, the Brotherhood began recruiting civilian scientists from the Capital Wasteland to assist with various projects. During this process, we were able to obtain the services of Dr. Madison Lee, a noted mind in the field of nuclear engineering. How did the Brotherhood meet Dr. Lee? She was part of a civilian project in the Capital Wasteland that the Brotherhood appropriated. It wasn't difficult to convince her to stay. That said, Dr. Lee's contributions to our cause were instrumental in maintaining order in the Capital Wasteland. After some time, she developed differences with the Brotherhood and exiled herself to the Commonwealth. We're fairly certain that her intent was to make contact with the Institute. What sort of differences? Although she was working with the Brotherhood of Steel, she never formally joined as a scribe. After the Capital Wasteland was secured, she objected to the Brotherhood's continued military presence there. I think she assumed we would just walk away from it. She was wrong. Your mission is simple. Once you're inside the Institute, we want you to track down Dr. Lee's whereabouts. If you find out that she's still alive, make contact with her and convince her to return to the Brotherhood of Steel. There's a special project we're working on, and it needs her attention. What's this project that needs her attention? Sorry, that information is classified. I'm sure you understand. Just keep your mind on the mission. And don't let anything they say sway you from your duty. Good luck, Knight. Alright. I have something urgent to report, Elder. The Institute is attempting to recover escaped synths at Bunker Hill. How did you obtain this information? Our reconnaissance hasn't reported anything of the sort. I thought I was your Institute reconnaissance. You're the only one that's been able to breach the Institute. But you're hardly the only source for information we have. We've been running round-the-clock vertebrate patrols. And we even have squads on the ground trying to pick up anything we can. Not to mention all the scribes we have monitoring radio traffic and trying to crack their RF encryption. I assure you, we have reconnaissance well in hand. I received the information from the Institute itself. And you've done the right thing by reporting this to me directly. Well done, soldier. Your report provides us with a golden opportunity to state our intentions to the Institute. I'm placing you in command of this mission. Exterminate the scents at Bunker Hill, and whomever the Institute sends to retrieve them. I'll instruct Kells to assign you the appropriate backup. Dismiss, soldier. Okay, so that's the Brotherhood informed. Next up is the Railroad. Oh yeah, this is going to be one hell of a fight. I'm probably going to die a few times in the crossfire, but it's going to be fun. There we go. Right here. Pam wants you. She explained why, but I couldn't figure it out. Uh, ready? I just heard the most fascinating rumor. The story goes that you actually found the Institute. Been there and back again. Sounds crazy, right? Where'd you hear that? Deacon brought it to my attention. And, as usual, he won't give up his source. It's all true. Deacon says you used teleportation. I can't imagine. 
You must feel justifiably proud of what your Minutemen have achieved in such a short time. Eventually, the Minutemen will devise their own plan to deal with the Institute. But I doubt your soldiers will place any priority on rescuing the Synths inside. I'm counting on you being as passionate about freeing Synths as we are. Please, work with us instead. Uh-huh. You think the Minutemen won't help the Synths? The Minutemen are a reflection of the character of the Commonwealth people. And time and time again, that character has been proven to be rotten. The Synths are tangible receptacles of their hatred of the Institute. Order them to help, and they'd mutiny. I'll work with you then. You have no idea how relieved I am to hear that. What I'm about to tell you is the most closely guarded secret the Railroad has. It's time you learn about Patriot. There's a man. Or woman, we're not sure, inside the Institute, who helps Synths escape to freedom. Dozens of Synths owe him their lives. We don't know his name. We've never had a way to contact him. So we gave him the code name Patriot. So you need to infiltrate the Institute and make contact with Patriot. I'll do my best. Excellent. Tom devised a way to send a message to Patriot. We can plant a coded message on an Institute terminal. And, if all goes well, he'll respond. Just see Tom, and you can proceed from there. Hey, it's Bullseye. Bullseye's back. Can I talk to you? Something on your mind? The Institute knows about Bunker Hill. They're planning to recapture the synths there. The timing couldn't be worse. The old man's been sitting on those four synths. There's nowhere else that's safe we could put them. Maintaining your cover is vital. But this, the sacrifice is just too great. How much damage would it cause if we let them hit us? We're running out of places to hide our synths. That's why we put so many eggs in one crowded basket to begin with. So what would we lose? Four synths, Stockton, some of our best agents, and the inevitable civilian casualties? No, not this time. We've never known when and where the Institute would strike us next. But now we have a chance to turn the tables. We wait until the enemy is in position, then we hit them, hard. No one they send out comes back alive except you. Understand? Won't the Institute be suspicious if I'm the only one left? You're a lot tougher than anyone else in their outfit. If only one person could survive, it would be you. And any story you come up with won't be contradicted. We can't attack too early. We need to draw them into the kill zone, and then spring the trap. You'll know when. You'll probably have a coarser escort. You'll have to take him down. You've done it before, but it'll still be dangerous. Like you said, I've done it before. It's a risk, but it's one we have to take. So get it done. Okay, so... I need to go and see Pam. Me as well. Confirming presence of rogue variable. Dispensing data. There are three independent reports of Courser activity. Analysis completed based on target's activity pattern, location, and suspected trajectory. Conclusion. The Institute is actively looking for railroad assets. Stop gap solution. Terminate Courser threats whenever possible. Seems logical to me. This unit's logic circuits are fully functional. Target designated Courser Alpha is in a defended location with lower generation synth targets. Eliminate Courser variable, leaving no survivors. End of discussion. Oh, cool. Okay. Not that far then. Uh, I'll deal with him some other time. Talk with Tinker Tom. Inside the belly of the beast? 
No time for that, though. Let's set you up to contact Patreon. I got here one genuine Tinker Time special. Just load her up onto a holotape, plug her into any institute terminal, and execute. All right. And now, time to go to Bunker Hill. The Alien Blaster and the Gamma Gun. I think I've used the Gamma Gun, but I'm not a fan of it. Don't think I got much damage done using it. What the? I wonder who or what they're protecting against. Why is he dressed and has the similar hairstyle to Sturgis, I wonder? I've been waiting for you. So, what's our situation? I assume you've been briefed? Our targets are inside. Four synths under railroad protection. Majority of the settlement is uninvolved and are expected to run for cover. The mission's parameters just changed. We're going shooting. Requesting backup relay now. Here we go. I'm quick saving. I got all those. Yeah, I got all those. Did they kill the one that was up here? Don't think they did.
Wow, missed every shot. Okay, I'm just trying to level out the playing field a bit. Ah, the Brotherhood one. And the Doctor's dead. Oh well. Well, this place took one hell of a beating. So, uh, who, who won exactly? It was the Brotherhood, yeah. And the railroad got wiped out. Oh well. I tried my best. Oh! He's gone rogue on me. Because he... Oh! Oh shit. Um. Alright, let me try to <laughs> load it up. Oh wow. Uh... Alright, let me try the go into that quick save. Oh, I didn't expect that. Mmm, lovely.
charge. I don't get it. How did these guys die? What am I doing? I might as well try using the... Uh ah, where is it? There it is. Okay, that didn't do much damage. Back to the other gun. That's the railroad, yeah. Cool. At least there's one person alive. I can take out the rest now. Oh god, that's coming down. Oh, wow. That's not right. There should be a door on the ocean there. Nope, never mind. Oh my god, how much...
Hey. What the hell? That settlement Lucas Miller was talking about? Wiped out. What the hell? They're shooting civilians now. Must have been wow. Damn it! Yeah, this is not an easy one. Uh. Just needed some Coca Cola there to uh, refill me because this is the third time I'm trying this now. Can't believe the first time I got through it, but just the Brotherhood one, and I was like, ah. Uh. Right, first time Brotherhood won, second time I died, third time is anyone's guess. Ah, no. Well, saved a little bit. I mean, not great, but saved a little bit later. Uh, over Overseer's Guardian, I think I need. I'll let them fight each other. And I'll just see who wins. frame rate dropping. That's, that's actually quite bad too. Charge! No, don't shoot at them.
How can I miss? I'm being so close to this guy and miss every shot, you know? Ah, misses every shot, man. Ugh. Idiot. What? Alright, I'm gonna go and do this. I have no idea what happened there. Deacon just left. Um, yeah, I, I no idea. I'm just going with it. What? Wait, wait, what? Well, Alright, this is not as fun as I remember it being. Um. Right, okay, let me go back to that one. Like, do, do I go to the synths? Or do I go back? I can't tell. Alright, let's look at the data, shall we? And look, uh... Speak with father in the ruins of CIT. So if I just leave here, <laughs> which is, you know, granted, not as epic as I was hoping it to be, but I can't really do anything. Actually, no, I've leveled up already. 
doesn't matter, I guess. Uh, yeah, because here it's just deal with the escaped synths, which I don't really want to do. But if I go here, I'm curious if I get like penalized for doing this. Like as soon as I spawn, Deacon just starts shooting at me and whatnot. I mean, if, if that is the case, there's not much I can do about it. Just accept his wrath. Because there's no way I can win that fight, I think. Ah, Deacon seems fine. CIT Rotunda. Is someone present? Someone there? I hear something. You must be terminated. Huh? What's that? A noise. My scanners must be malfunctioning. I heard something. I can hear you. We are unstoppable! Alright, so we've cleared out the super mutants here. Is there another area that I haven't explored? That could be it. Yep, this seems promising. There we go. You know, in all my years, I've never set foot outside the Institute. Not once. Since the day they brought me here. I've never had a reason. But now, this just confirms the truth I've always known. The Commonwealth is dead. There's no future here. The only hope for humanity lies below. So why come out here? To put things in perspective, I suppose. Standing here, I'm reminded of how fortunate I am that I was spared a life in this wasteland. I know that to you, I was kidnapped from that vault. In truth, the Institute rescued me. Both of us, really. But why refreeze me? As a failsafe, of course. I was the perfect candidate. An infant with uncorrupted DNA. But if something were to go wrong, if I died, well, the Institute realized a contingency plan was prudent. Another source of pre-war DNA, preferably related to their primary subject. It only made sense that my parents should fill that role. So you were kept alive and safe within the vault. I'll admit, when I had you released from Vault 111, I had no expectations that you'd survive out here in all this. To not only do so, 
but manage to find me. To infiltrate the Institute itself. Extraordinary. Why let me out now? After all this time? That's... Well, that's hard to explain. Certainly, it was no longer necessary to keep you suspended. I... Well, I suppose I wanted to see what would happen. An experiment of sorts. I had no idea what kind of man you were, you see. Would the Commonwealth corrupt you? As it has everything else. Would you even survive? Perhaps most curious to me. Would you... After all this time... Attempt to find me? And now I know the answer. Well, here I am. Was it worth it? I believe so. Soon, I hope... I hope you'll understand. Everything I've done has been for the future. A future which I hope is not in jeopardy after recent events. Bunker Hill did not go well for us. Would you care to explain what happened? I hope you're not too overwhelmed. Alright, back now. Sorry about that. Family. One of my family members knocked on the door. Um, this really is a matter of importance. Ambush. We were totally ambushed. They were waiting for us. You can imagine that I find that very hard to believe, given that all the intelligence leading up to this indicated we'd taken them by surprise. Bunker Hill was to cement your place as a valuable asset to the Institute. It will now only raise suspicions. And to see the Brotherhood of Steel involved in this? They had no way of knowing what was going on. I will refrain from sharing the outcome with the Directorate for the moment. Things are already in motion that this would only derail. Speaking of which... It's time for you to become more involved in the future of the Institute. I'd like you to join me inside. The Directorate is meeting, and you should be there. I'll be waiting. I've seen enough. It's time to go back in. Oh! Okay, so... That Battle of Bunker Hill wasn't as monumental as I was hoping. Uh, mostly because I had Deacon with me, so if the Railroad lost that battle, he'd just turn on me. And I assume if the Railroad lost, then I'd just... they just cut ties with me anyway, so... I'm not sure. Uh, not so fussed about the Brotherhood cutting ties with me, but... Then again, the Brotherhood and the Institute were the heaviest. Were like the heaviest armed and defended ones there, I guess. So I, th I suppose the Brotherhood was the most heavily armed and best defended, thanks to the power armor. Oh well. I'm still uh, Deacon's here, so I'm still sort of tied to the railroad. Um. I still got those quests for yeah I still got the quests for the Brotherhood of Steel so I haven't cut ties with them either it's a win-win situation really anyway I am going to call this episode to an end and in the next episode I'm going to be carrying on with the main stuff Mankind Redefined um, I'm going to do some of these other things as well like underground, undercover, and from within. If you could leave a like for this video, it would help a great deal, as would a comment down below, and maybe, just maybe, hitting that subscribe button that should be appearing on the screen at any moment. Just hit the icon for my channel, and you've subscribed, and you can keep up to date with all the walkthrough, the rest of this walkthrough, and the walkthroughs to come, and you can also check out some of the playlists I've done already. Thank you all for watching, it means a lot. 
For now though, that's pretty much it, so until the next episode, you take care of yourself and have a good day.